The first feature film from the Miraculous franchise, Miraculous Ladybug and Cat Noir, the movie, has premiered. Fans of the series know that the Miraculous story follows Marinette and Adrian. Fans all over the world are super excited for this first feature film featuring the two. And by the looks of it, this movie will not disappoint. Expanding the franchise only means more Ladybug and Cat Noir for everyone. Miraculous is already a pretty big deal as it is, with the original series gaining huge popularity across five seasons and 130 episodes. However, this movie has a lot of differences from the series, and in this video, we're going to talk about them. Firstly, this movie is more of a musical type of content. That heavily tears it away from the original TV show. Marinette, Gabriel, and even Tiki are singing their very own songs. However, when we turn back to the series, it's a classic storytelling mechanism. It's also because Jeremy is directing the movie, and it's Thomas Ashtrick who's writing the seasons. We also know that Marinette is clumsy, a bit awkward, and quick to panic, which includes the times when she approaches her crush. That's why we love her, and that's why it's pleasant to watch her gaining confidence as she becomes Ladybug. However, at the beginning of the movie, I feel like it's a little too exaggerated. Marinette is always that girl who is always clumsy and she's being a big subject of mockery from all the students in the school. Again, it's a bit exaggerated. This directly gives classic American superhero origin vibes. A huge difference begins when Marinette and Adrian meet. In the series, Adrian is part of the class and he meets Marinette when he tries to take the gum out of her chair in order to protect her, but he was misunderstood. This is completely different in the movie. Our lovebirds are meeting up in the library of the school, but there's one thing that doesn't change. Adrian finds Marinette to be very strange in the beginning. LOL. In the original series, we didn't see Adrian's childhood or any moments when Gabriel and Emily were together. However, in the movie, there's a whole scene that shows the happy family picture. Not only that, but throughout the movie, we see a lot of Emily flashbacks, which reminds us of the dynamic of the Agreste arc. Gabriel is so lonely and misses his wife so much. He sees her inside of the dresses he created and Adrian sees his mother on the stage. Emily's being an actress was revealed in season two. So we didn't know explicit things about her. However, the movie explicitly reveals all these facts. In the movie, just like the beginning of the series, Gabriel is transforming into Hawk Moth, thanks to the Butterfly Miraculous. However, he's not really enjoying this transformation. Another interesting detail is when he received the Miraculous of the Butterfly, he gets some future scenarios in his head. In the movie, instead of his Kwame, Master Fu understands that the evil power is rising, meaning that someone is using the Butterfly Miraculous. Funny enough, unlike Fu's decision, Destiny itself chooses the owner of these Miraculouses. Marinette and Adrian. Fu and Marinette meet when Marinette was escaping from Chloe and Fu is chasing the flying miraculous. However, the thing that happened in the series also happens in the movie. Marinette saves Fu from a car. And at that moment, the earrings get placed into Marinette's bag. The only thing weird here is that Fu is very vocal about Marinette being the one and saving the world and everyone watches them. That was the part that should have been created a little bit better, I guess. Adrian receives the Miraculous of the cat when he's in his room, and Marinette receives it when she's in Master Fu's lair. Similar enough to the original series, Marinette gets so scared after Tiki appears all of a sudden, and she's really hesitant to become a superhero. It varies from the original series that the first akumatization of the movie is an ordinary man who proposes to a woman, but he gets rejected. However, in the original series, it's Ivan who gets the honor of the first akumatization, even though Marinette rejects being Ladybug, and we're going to talk about that in a few minutes. The heroes get used to being superheroes really easily, and they defeat all these supervillains super easy. Seeing that Gabriel has prepared a huge attack, we haven't even seen this kind of thing in the series. Just like the first part of the origin, Marinette gives up being Ladybug and removes her earrings. And just like that, Tiki disappears. However, this time, she's not really free like in the original series. She throws the earrings away, but they come back in any scenario because Destiny has chosen her. But again, just like in Origins, things are getting out of hand. Our heroes are needed, 
And this is the moment where Marinette understands the seriousness of the situation. She commands Tiki to transform. In the movie, aside from defeating the villains, Marinette and Adrian are spending their time with each other. Thanks to Ali and Nino. They get to know each other. Of course, Marinette is in love with Adrian, and Adrian is in love with Ladybug, crazily. Adrian, as Cat Noir, confesses his love with the song that they are singing. However, Ladybug refuses it, saying that there's already someone in her heart. And even though our Marinette is awkward and easy to panic, she gains enough confidence to confess her interest for him. She offers to go to the ball together, as a couple. And she gets rejected. You know, because just like I said, Adrian is in love with Ladybug, of course. As the movie goes on, a classic we're walking into is the result. Both sides are sad because of the impossible love. Meanwhile, Gabriel, who sees that these heroes are capable of defeating all these villains that he akumatizes, has a new plan. He wants to akumatize himself. This is the last attack of the Hawk Moth. With his enchanted power, Paris is under attack and everywhere explodes. The whole sky gets dark. Everywhere is under fire. Once the heroes face Hawk Moth, things don't go as they planned. In the movie, the confrontation scene is a bit darker than the series. Cat Noir passes out heavily, and while Ladybug tries to protect him, Hawk Moth uses this moment to his advantage. He steals the Ladybug Miraculous and throws Ladybug away. And yeah, Marinette's identity already gets revealed. But Adrian doesn't know about it yet because his mind was closed. Different from the series, Hawk Moth includes the Ladybug Miraculous to his brooch, which is the Miraculous of Butterfly. He also becomes done with Adrian as soon as he realizes that it's his son. So despite the series, Gabriel already knows that Marinette is Ladybug and Adrian is Cat Noir. Adrian also learns that his dad is Hawk Moth. Marinette, who is watching them, learns that Adrian is Cat Noir and that Gabriel is Hawk Moth too. Hawk Moth abandons the evil power and explains to Adrian why he's doing this. Aside from the season five finale, Adrian and Gabriel face each other with the truth and they hug each other. In the finale, Marinette arrives at the ball with a beautiful dress. Sadly, we don't see anything like that in the original series. She finds Adrian and calls out to him as Cat Noir, revealing that she knows his identity. Marinette exposes herself and reveals that she is Ladybug. The love square ends and now they know each other and their secrets. They almost share a kiss, but that's when the sequence ends. Ugh, so close again! At the finale, Gabriel tells Nathalie that he's the only one he can count on and says from now on, they're going to be the guardians. And then we hear Gabriel's voice. Nathalie walks and appears in front of Emily, who is in a coma. There's a huge difference here between the movie and the series. Emily is usually kept in a room and not in a capsule. She's surrounded by flowers and she sleeps under a tree. Okay guys, so those are all the main differences between the movie and the series. What do you guys think about this? Did you go to the cinema and watch the movie too? I wonder what you guys think of it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel, like the video, and comment your ideas and theories down below. I'll see you in the next one. Bye!